West Philly strong because of fitness. <laughs> Philadelphia and I like to inspire through fitness. <laughs> so a couple of the workouts I did during COVID-19, my favorite one was a squat. So you pretty much just, you wanna just squat down knee length, make sure your leg is lined up with your back, make sure your back is straight and your arms is out straight forward and you wanna come right back up. You're gonna go knee length down and then you're gonna rise back up. One, <laughs> two, that's three. I hope you guys are really doing this home because if you're not, I'm gonna be really, really mad. <laughs> Four, five. I'm a single mom of two. I have a 12 year old, which is my son. He's my older boy. <laughs> and I have a 10 year old, which is my daughter. What inspired me to begin my fitness journey is pretty much being a single mom, being raised in lower poverty. We grow up in local neighborhoods and we just strive to become a better us every each and every day. So how did I find achievability? Or can I say, how did achievability find me? <laughs> I was dating my children's father. I was inside of an abusive relationship. And then one day I went to work and opened the computer and boom, it was there, achievability. The second workout of COVID-19 would be knee up. So you're gonna start with your left knee with your right elbow and it works on your lower core. So we're gonna, let's go. One, <laughs> two, three, four, knee up. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And do not hold it, <laughs> you let it go. So now we're gonna switch from your right knee to your left elbow. So we're going here. One, two, Achievability has a mentor program. The AMP program pretty much just pairs you up with a mentor who can kind of like show you the way through life. She actually inspired me to begin my business. She would check in every month with me to see where what level was I on when it came to research to my business. Through the pandemic, Achievability has actually, they helped out a lot. They did their day rounds with phone calls. They made sure we had help when it came to rental assistance if we weren't employed. Also, they helped out with food as well. As things begin to open up, I just would love for the community to come out and to get more involved with each other and to network with each other through fitness. So the third favorite workout is gonna be lunges. I mean, who can't do a lunge and who doesn't love a lunge? It's the easiest workout you can ever imagine, right? <laughs> so we're gonna start with the right foot. You're gonna bend your knee and make sure your back knee is adjacent to your front knee. So the, this is my first lunge. So you're gonna go one, you're gonna go back up, you're gonna take your left knee, you're gonna do the same thing as your right knee. So you're gonna go down. This is the second one, that's two. That's three. That's four. And make sure you're breathing when you're actually doing these exercises. That's five. Through achievability, I've learned to handle my hardships because they say after hardships comes ease. So having housing for me means to me, um, and I'm independent. You have to become independent and learn to strive to become a better person, a better you for a better tomorrow. Life is about breaking generational cycles. So when we look down at lower poverty, we'll see mom, doing what grandmom did, and seeing what grandmom doing what great grandmom did. But how can we break a generational cycle? We do different. We, talk, we take the harder route. We kind of become a, what our generation needs, right? So that, that actually was, inspires me to wake up every day. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the workouts with those three techniques that I showed you. So I want you guys to try this at home, and then I want you to let me know what's your result. So thank you once again for watching my fitness journey and hopefully you guys get inspired. <laughs>